Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what is the syntax of finding element by class using CSS selectors? Let me answer. In order to locate an element with the help of class in CSS selectors, there's a shortcut symbol known as dot symbol, which should be followed by the class name. Let me practically demonstrate this for you. For that, I'll open this browser. In this browser, I'll take you to one sample application URL that is umaya.blogspot.com. Okay. In this application URL, there is a button. When I inspect this button in the HTML code, it will contain a class attribute. Okay. This particular button has a class attribute with some class attribute value. If I have to locate this button with only just class attribute value, Okay, then what I have to do in CSS selectors? Select this HTML code of this button and say Control F. You'll get this kind of text field where you can write the CSS selectors. Now, as I already told you, copy this class attribute value, copy this top down drop button, drop BDN class attribute value of this button, and simply say dot, just type dot, and followed by give this copied value, paste it, drop button. That's it. Okay, so it should locate. So here, the Google Chrome DevTools is not perfectly working. So we can take the help of this selector sub. It's very easy to install this selector sub. Okay. Sometimes Google Chrome DevTools, uh, the, the CSS selector is correct, but uh, you know, the Google Chrome DevTools uh, works in a different manner sometimes. So this is not working properly here. Three elements are getting located. This is not correct. So let's use a better tool for uh, using the CSS selector. For that, we can use the CSS, uh, this uh, XPath, uh, tool that is selector sub tool. So how to install this selector sub? Just search for selector sub, selector sub, and you'll go to this home page of selector sub. On the home page, you'll find this uh, selector sub. Just click on this. Okay, just click on this and uh, it will ask you to choose a browser. Since it is Chrome browser, I'll say Chrome install. It will take you to the Google Chrome store. In my machine, it is already there. So it's asking me to remove, okay, or uninstall. But in your case, you'll get installed. Once you install it and the plugins, you'll get this and you can pin it and you'll get it here. Okay, this icon. Okay, this is the process to install the selector sub. Since selector sub is already there in my machine, I'll I'll just do one thing. I'll right click inspect this drop button. Okay, it's, uh, this is this full Chrome DevTools is not working properly. So I right click inspect this. We got the HTML code, but here in the sub tags of this elements like styles, computed layout, in the last one, there will be selector sub. They select that, expand this. Now here you can type the same thing. Okay. I want to locate this drop down button, inspect this drop down button. It has a class attribute value as drop button. Copy this. And you just have to type dot followed by drop button. Press enter. How many elements are getting located? Only one element that is this drop button is getting located. Okay. So you see this CSS selector with the dot is working fine. Okay. So hope guys you understood uh, the syntax for finding the element by using the class attribute value using CSS in CSS selectors. Okay. With the help of simple dot followed by the class name, we can locate. Okay. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye bye.